Hey you guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today I'm going to be doing a love reading for the Zodiac sign of Virgo. I know you guys have been gone for this channel for like two months, but your girl is back and better. Okay, I'm about to start getting back active on this channel. Okay, so be looking out for your your sign. Okay, also make sure you um, look at your birth chart and see what other signs that's um in your chart okay so you can watch those other videos as well but don't forget to like this video comment and subscribe okay so let's see i'm using what's brewing spill the beans by fire witch tarot if you're interested in this deck but let's see what's going on for virgo spirit guys the love and light and such so mass is my angel of the light also you guys i'm offering tarot workshops Okay, just email me. I'm also doing promos on my channel. And I'm also um, doing personal readings. So if you're interested, just email me. My email is in the description box down below. Okay, so let's see what's going on for Virgo. So we have investigating. Okay, so somebody here could be watching you. I just heard watching your page. It's like you have a stalker here. You probably don't even know that somebody is investigating or watching you. For some of you guys, y'all probably do know. We have tantric sex and reverse. Okay. But some just tell me to take it up right. So I'm going to read the, the card both ways. Okay. But I'm seeing here that somebody here could be trying to send you sex magic. Projecting sex onto you. Okay. You could be trying to see if somebody has been doing this to you. Okay. All I'm seeing here that somebody here could be lying said they never did that to you, but you know your body. You could have did some research to see, you know, how do you know somebody's doing sex magic on you or something like that? Or they could be doing any type of magic. I just heard they could be doing black magic, all type of shit. Okay, and it's like you could be investigating this person trying to catch them or something like that. Okay. Yeah, I'm seeing you attracted the wrong type of person. Here. You attracted a mafia. Okay, somebody here is a book. They won't leave you alone. It's like somebody here is trying to um bring you in. Yeah, by doing this dispel work on you. Yeah, outdated, expired, disused, old news, discarded. Yeah, so you're getting rid of this person. This person's old news, and it's like they don't like the fact that you're getting rid of them. So it's like now they feel like they have to do spell work and shit to bring you back to them. Yeah, writing it out. Yeah, did I say that? Somebody here is writing it out. They're saying like, I don't know if the ex is person, did they do this? Of course, they're not going to tell you that they did this. But some guys could have asked them, you know, just to hear their voice, you know, or you just probably ask them in person to get their body language. Because you know when somebody lying, you know. Like, they're going to give it away for sure. So, it's like you don't want the excess person off guard or something to see how they would react to it. <sighs> or you're playing it like you, you like this person the whole time. You could either be, you know, I don't know if you could be in the house or something when they're not there. You could be trying to find shit or clues or something or go through their phone or something. Yeah, somebody is a hater and they don't want to see you with nobody else. Okay. Or they know that you probably messing with somebody else and they hate that. What else? Depression. Yes, this person is depressed. Diamond girl born to shine. Hmm. So you could be in the spotlight here. You could get a lot of attention. Okay, we have caution. Yeah, you need to move with caution with this person. I don't know if this person that you're dealing with, they could be flashy, wear a lot of jewelry or fun money or stuff like that or break a lot. Okay, but yeah, be careful around this person. This person has some type of mental issues. They don't have all their screws, literally. Like their screws is loose here. This person, they're projecting a lot of stuff onto you. Okay, we have here spoiled, getting um getting spoiled, treating, catering, etc. Yeah, so I don't know if you either spoiled this person. Okay, you could have been a provider to this person, and it's like this person I want you to go anywhere. This person is just using this because they want the money from you. Yeah, this person could be trying to lure you in sexually. Okay, so you could get them what they want or something like that. I don't know if somebody here pays for sex or something. 
We have promiscuous, sleeps around, a whole free for all, sleeps with your man, insecure. Hmm. So this could have been somebody here that you just probably just slept with. There's nothing serious with this person. For some of you guys, this could be somebody here that you've known for a long time. Okay. I'm seeing two different stories here. What else? Yeah, somebody here likes to find things in life. They would do anything to get attention. Okay. Somebody here wants to shine. They want it. They want um all eyes on them. Yeah, somebody here is spending a lot of their time doing their spell work. Whatever the fuck they're doing. They're, they're, yeah. This person could do this to a lot of different other people to get what they want to get money from them or something like that. Yeah, we got a move of caution with this person. This bitch is crazy. Yeah, under spiritual attack. Fighting off negative energies, fighting spiritual welfare, needing to clear your energy. Like somebody here... Jesus Christ. Literally, somebody here needs Jesus Christ. Like, you need to go to church, bitch. Something. Chill out. Yeah, this person could smoke cigarettes or just smoke a lot. Okay, and they're trying to chill themselves out because they're just waiting to see how this, you know, this, this spell work is going to work. You know, is it going to bring you back in to them? You know? But yeah, some of you guys need to up your spiritual protection here. But somebody here is sending you a lot of spell, negative energies. Yeah, see? Did I just say that? Stay, stay centered, aligning yourself with the universe. Like, the cards is not lying. Like, you see these cards. Like, Virgo, I don't know if you're doing this or somebody's doing this to you, but protect yourself, for real. Okay? Yeah, you need to stay centered and align yourself with the universe, okay? You do some meditation or something. Make sure you're eating healthy as well. Okay, getting played. Manipulation lies, control, and pulling the strings. Yeah, so somebody here is getting played. Okay. Yeah, this probably could have been you, Virgo. You could have been getting played. Somebody here has been doing this to you for a long ass time. Or this person, I don't know if they just started doing this shit. And you caught this person. I really feel like you caught this person. Okay. Yeah. Knowing they fucked up. Yeah, this person knows that they fucked up. And you found out. Yeah, and they know that you definitely not going to want them to do what they ask now. This person was trying to keep you around. Like, this person was obsessed and possessive. Yeah, like, literally. Yeah, they're in their feelings now. Somebody here could drink a lot of liquor as well. But yeah, they're crying. They're mad. This person could probably be saying that they have a baby on the way to keep you. Because they you found out everything that the fuck they was doing now they're trying to bring a baby into this or something oh god i don't know this person could probably be lying about a baby so make sure that this baby is yours if they're really pregnant make sure this person is, yeah this baby is yours somebody here is going to be having a mitch carriage or something like that or a baby's not going to make it because this is their karma here for either doing some type of spell work or they either was trying to how you get them pregnant so that you could be stuck with them to trap you or some shit like that. Oh god, this is ridiculous. We have copycat. Yeah, this person doesn't have their own identity neither at all. We have here get in a room, hotel, motel, sweet business, pleasure. See, they could have been cheating on you. Yep. And yeah, y'all get into arguments with this person. You're brainstorming. You're finding shit out of this person. Okay. Yeah, you can either be going to check yourself. Yeah, you're running away from this bitch. <laughs> you're getting the fuck up out of there. <laughs> okay, so. Let's see. What are some hint truth messages that this person wants to tell Rego? Hey guys, little might and sister masters ready to pray. There are some hint messages that this person wants to throw over go. You don't know how hard it was to let you go. We have here, I'm grateful for the spiritual lesson. Yeah, this person was definitely came to life to teach you a spiritual lesson. 
and this person didn't want to let you go. You see, you don't know how hard it was to let you go. Like, they just couldn't let you go. So they chose to do all this motherfucking spell work and shit. Like, weirdo. I left when I saw you with someone. Yeah, so this person could have got a room or something to cheat on, cheated on you or something like that. But I'm seeing this person already knew that you was like, you feel me? They already knew, if anything, that you was a player or something. You were the best thing in my life. So I'm this person keep, like, I don't know if they could be emailing you or keep calling or texting you or something like that. Yeah. I'm seeing here, it's like, for some of you guys, yeah, this person knew that you cheated or something like that. Like, they been know that you was either a player. For some of you guys, you probably didn't play with this person. And for some of you guys, y'all did. And this person wanted you to themselves. I'm afraid to contact you. Yeah, I would be too. This person feel like you were the best thing in their life, so they didn't want you to leave them, I guess. What else? Uh, we have need to let each other go. Yeah, y'all need to let each other go. The time just wasn't right for us. The time will never be right for you guys. Okay, this is like, this is over. This is done. Okay, but I am getting that this person, when I, when I read this card, I said I left when I saw you with someone. I feel like they copied you, you know? They could have got a room with somebody or something like that to either make you mad or something. So be, I'm just... If this person is pregnant for real, for real, make sure this baby is yours. Okay? Because bitches be bringing babies in this world trying to be, you know, trying to chop somebody. Okay? Bringing this baby in this world for the wrong reasons. And then you end up having a karmic baby and this baby end up stressing you out. Okay? That's because you didn't have this baby out of love. You know? You had this baby to try to chop somebody. Okay, for the wrong reasons. But I hope this video gave you guys a lot of clarity. If it did, don't forget to like this video, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.